Just when you think you're done, they pull you right back in. They pull you right back in. Scalar 2 is back. What's up YouTube, it is Hollywood Floss, the worst producer of all time, back with another video. In today's video, we're gonna look at Scalar 2.4. Yes, the new update from Scalar 2.4. It's like they knew Core Jam was coming. And so they was like, you know what, we're gonna let them get a little shine. And then we're gonna come right back with an update. But before we get into the Scalar 2.4 update, make sure you hit the like and subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you can get any video I upload to the channel. You know, I'm always doing giveaways with loop kits or MIDI kits or drum loops. And I also sell beats on Beat Stars. And you know, we go live and we play the listeners' music. So hit the notification bell so you can know when I'm going live or hit the notification bell so you know I'm getting a new video on YouTube. We're going to dive right into it. I have Scalar 2 open. Man, you know, I was, it's like they heard me. I was like, I was messing with chord jammers like I was cheating. And then Scalar 2 was like, no, you need to come back home. I need you. Okay. So let's look at this. Scalar 2 has added a couple of new things to the roster. It was already one of the best, if not the best, um, VST that's come out in a while. And, um. It just keeps beefing up. It's like it's keep on taking steroids to get bigger, right? So we're going to get right into it. One of the first things that uh, we complained about was in, bu in buying mode. Matter of fact, first go up here. Okay, you're going to go up here, hit this little screw. And it used to only say only white. Now you can do all keys. So you get the black keys in the bind. It used to only, you can only get the white keys when you're trying to bind the chords and hit one note down and play all the chords. So you're going to go to all all right and then you can close it out pick a scale all right and then bind it and now you can see it's not just the white keys you can go to the black keys in the scale so this helps out with true detection and it helps out on um, MP NPCs where it's it's not like in line you can get everything in line so let's look at how this sounds It looks, it sounds, sounds beautiful, okay? And the fact that you can go up and down to the keys even when you control everything or highlight every key and you put it in the stay in key mode, you're able to learn what you're doing the correct way. Excellent, excellent, excellent addition. So now not just the bind key and the white keys, you got them in the black keys. All right, and they added some sounds, man. They added they added some sounds. This, they added a wild pluck. All right, anytime we get some new sounds, hybrid keys. We love the new sounds, so keep on adding those sounds. I don't care if it takes up all of I don't care if it takes up all of my memory. Keep on adding those sounds. I love the addition to that. So that is one thing, the bind and then the new sounds. And then what you all been waiting for, you already know. Da 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 da. We go in here and we look. No, we're not gonna go there first. We're gonna go here first. Common chord progressions. Now, the only thing Scalar really was behind in was giving us popular chord progressions. So they have figured out a way to catch up to Captain Chords, figured out a way to catch up to Chord Jam in one update by adding the most common chords. Okay, and they don't just give us just like 10. <laughs> Look at this. So they, if you want the playful one, two, three, four, five chord, and then they say, hey, okay, we can even take it further. You want triads, you want simples, you want thickened, thickened, colored. Let's, oh, I'm sorry. Let's change. Let's go with the hybrid keys. Okay, and then we're gonna go back. And oh, okay, so we're ready. And we're gonna bind it. Okay, so right there, we are ready to go with that. Okay, so. That is chord progression. Let's look at some other chord Longing. Let's 
Maybe it's a little too weak. There we go. And these are just common chord progressions that they've added, resolving chord progressions. So now, if you have any more trouble, you can go here and say, okay, what are some common chord progressions? And when they say common chord progression, these are chord progressions that most popular songs over the history of time are using. And you get the mood. So say if you want a uplifting or a triumphant song, simple, okay, they got it for you. And this would be a one, six, four, five. And what's good about this is this is true like if you go and you was to take a part a Bruce Springsteen song all the way up to a Kelly Clarkson song these are the chord progression they're playing okay they're playing simple chord progressions because it's figured out through time that pop songs with some of the same chord progressions will still be hits why not keep on going so I love that they added the common chord progressions yes oh let's get one more dramatic you can go through these in the new 2.4 update. All right, you could go through them. And I'm just using the, the bind. That's all I'm doing, all right? That's all I'm doing. All right. So we have the, what else has been added? Metal. They finally have a metal section for the metal heads out there. I'm not too versed in metal, but let's let's take it off performance. Let's just Okay, I'm pretty sure that you know you would need <laughs> That's great to see that they put the metal in there. They also have EDM. They also have EDM to the table. We've added 17. Okay. And then, as far as the performance modes, they've added sequences and new bass techniques. So they've added some common bass, straight bass. They've added this to the table. That is dope that they've added some more bass. And let's look at the sequences that they've added. Common sequences, basic. Okay. And when they say sequences, that's just like the melody or the riff that they want you to go to. And let's take this down here. And let's see how it looks when we drag it over from the MIDI. So they're actually. You can actually drag in your riff over okay that is dope that is dope i must say basic three let's see if it changes so this is how it looks right now let's see when we drag over basic three does it change from basic two it indeed does all right and then we're gonna go do one more all right, we're going to go to Common Sequences, Ostefanato, 15. Let's see how that... Oh, that's crazy. Let's see how that moves over. All right, and then... When we go to our EDM, let's do something else in EDM, and then let's see what else we can find. 
as far as sequences common basic 12 see how that reacts okay and we're gonna move that over okay not bad not bad so what do you think of the new scalar 2.4 update leave a comment below has scalar 2.4 regained the crown of the best core generator the best uh whatever you want to call it uh, i guess a core generator of all time because it was in my number one spot it has some stiff competition but it comes back one week later with an update let me know in the comments do you like 2.4 do you want them to keep keep on adding artists chord progressions and song chord progressions common chord progressions bass sequences riffs melodies do you want them to keep on adding that or do you just want them to stop so you can play what you got is too much let me know in the comments below it's your boy hollywood floss the worst producer of all time follow me on instagram hw floss leave a comment leave that like man um if you need any help uploading this or if you need any help uh, learning the scale of 2.4 let me know i will help out i'll let your boy